Good afternoon, good people of YouTube. I thought what to do next and I heard this Marilyn Manson song, Personal Jesus, of course a cover. And I thought of Shockwave. Now it, I know it is a, a world's smallest transform. I'm not sure if it's uh, original or a knockoff. I, I, I think it's a... Uh, it's a, it's a knockoff, but I'm, I'm not really uh, sure about this one. But um, I thought, hey, I was dying to get this uh, out of uh, out of his package. So uh, let's uh, let's open him. Uh, there we go. The seal is broken. And what do we have here? Mm. Ah, there he is. Of course, with his little uh, instructions, but I don't think I'm gonna need uh, that with this one. And of course, uh, the fist of Bruticus. I never quite understood why they uh, put that thing in here, but oh well. And it says. It has a letter, letter R on it, the R of right. Hmm. Okay, so here he is. Let's get him out of his plastic prison. Ah. And I must say, he looks very good, very good. I had this one as a child. Uh, G1 shockwave and I can't remember what happened to it perhaps I took it apart or some other kid took it away without letting me know <laughs> that's also a possibility but yeah even the little rubber hose is on it so I must say I really like this one very detailed color is perfect also has a little uh, a little visor a little uh, uh, little thing little purple translucent thing so let's get this uh, little dude in robot mode we take this part off and let's see we gotta put this back here and This one is very stiff because it's brand new. Okay, take the legs apart if it wants to. Uh, new toys, what can you do? Normally, he would. The legs must be must go apart, but. For some reason, they don't want to. Okay, take the feet out. That went well. And of course, take the arms apart. And the head comes up with his little antennas. Oh, there goes the head. Now that is a small guy, that is very small, I can't get his uh, legs in the right position, it's really stiff and I'm afraid of breaking uh, the little bastard, but yeah, he looks uh, very detailed, the head won't stay up, that's a minor thing, but perhaps it is with a lot of other uh, little shock waves but looking at it yeah this brings back memories looking very good here well the little ball joint in his uh, left elbow is a little loose but 
we can fix that. But yeah, I like this one. I thought it would uh, <laughs> it would look like shit, but nope. So I have a, a miniature version of G1 Shockwave. Hooray! But yeah, I'm I'm, uh, I'm quite pleased. Perhaps this uh, this one goes very well with one of the uh, masterpieces. So uh, yeah, I'm uh, I'm okay with this one. Let's put him back in his uh, in his uh, gun mode. I'm. I'm really amazed with the amount of detail these uh, these little guys have. I, I never thought it would be uh, it would be like this. I saw, of course, I saw a couple of reviews, but I'm uh, I'm really amazed. Oh, put these back. Clip them together like so. Put this back. Yeah, me likey. So I think I'm gonna put him in. Uh, I try to put this guy in. Um, well, Devastator is a no go because I don't have a custom hands for it. But I think uh, if I can get him to hold it, Masterpiece Megatron, or. Uh, uh, Starscream is also a no-go, I think, but I'll give it a try. So, uh, yeah, guys, here's a very happy Bruce McLeod here with his uh, little shockwave. Okay, well, me and little shockwave are going to say goodbye now, but um, I hope you like this uh, funny little review. And uh, see you guys all later. Take care. Bye-bye.